Okay, in this video, I'm going to talk about um, cutting a hole in a polygon mesh. Okay, so first, uh, let's select these two uh, meshes here and c command D to duplicate them. And then I am going to first, we need to uh, combine these two meshes together in order to create a hole using the sphere on this um, on this mesh. So I go ahead and click here to combine these two together and we go ahead and delete our history. Okay, perfect. Now we have this mesh combined together. <clears throat> and now we can go and select our to the mesh tool, make hole tool, mesh tools, make hole. And I'm going to go to the options here. All right. And let's see what are the differences between these options. For more, actually, for more information on differences between these options, uh, I put um, a, a link to a related uh, um, to the related uh, page on this uh, on a Maya Autodesk Maya 2016. So you can find it on. You you should go to the related uh, post I have on my website. So I put a link there. Okay, let's bring in our tool setting here and first start by none so what you need to do is to click here click the f the, the first surface then click the next one you don't need to hold shift just click first and second clip and then press enter okay now we create a hole uh, like this okay as you can see let's come on z and again select our make hole tool here and let's see what first does let's select okay the first first select here second select this one and press enter and this is what first uh, option um, does command z and reselect and let's see what the project first does select this one this one and press enter and uh, the difference between those two was uh, Let's come and Z. Actually, let's select this one and this one, and then select first. Enter. Okay, it it basically place it at the center, but when I select a project first, this one, this one, and enter, it put it and uh, directly under under the the location of the sphere. Okay. Now let's try the middle, select this one, this one, and press enter. So what middle does, as you could see here, this was the position of our sphere. This was the position or, or the this face of our mesh. And uh, by doing the middle, it create a hole somewhere in between and put the hole in somewhere in between of these two okay and now let's see what actually project middle do click here click here and enter so project middle does the same but this time our um, our cube uh, is not distorted and it exactly put the um, sphere uh, in its own position, not somewhere in between. Okay, and now let's try the other one, uh, the second. Okay, let's click this one, click this one, enter. So it makes the cube taller, okay, to the position of our sphere and create a, uh, the hole exactly on the position of our sphere. Okay, like this. Command Z, and let's see what the other option does. Uh, let's see the difference between second and project second. Select this one, then select this one and enter. Okay, this is the uh, like that without any distortion and and uh, it looks like those are the same. Let me see actually. Let's go select the second and see what is the difference. Oh no, here is with distortion, but 
if you go to the project second second would be without this distortion okay and now let's try the last one which is none select this this and enter and as you can see it's create a hole and basically create this then change our mesh to this 